Let's graph the linear equation y equals 1 6 x. And here's how we'll do it. We can use a table of values, but it's probably easier to use slope intercept formula. In this case, we have y equals mx plus b, but there's no b here. All you have to do is just say plus 0, and that's going to be the y intercept. So we'll go to the y axis here and 0. That's where the line for y equals 1 6 x, that's going to cross the y axis. For the slope, m, we have 1 6. And we can think of that as rise over run. So we rise 1 and we go over 6. So let's do that. We go to the y intercept, we go up 1, we go over 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So we have two points. Let's do another one. We could rise 1 and go over 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, but we are off our graph paper then. You can see it's in a line though. Let's go in the other direction, the opposite direction. So we go back to the y-intercept, we go down one and go to the left, one, two, three, four, five, six. And you can see that's right there on our line as well. Let's put a line through that. And then let's get rid of this since it's off our graph paper there. Put arrows to show that our line goes to infinity. And that's the graph for y equals one sixth x. Note again, you could have used the table values. Here we used slope intercept formula, and especially when you have a fraction in your equation, this is particularly easier to use. This is Dr. B graphing the equation y equals 1 6 x. Thanks for watching.